Salam HD family, Kahwa House just entered the Chicago scene and not only is this Muslim owned coffee shop worth all the hype, they are definitely worth all our support. Additionally, because these organic coffee beans are sourced from Yemen itself, we are also supporting our brothers and sisters in Yemen. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala help them. Ameen. That being said, today we have awesome must try recommendations for you as they have tons of options. We start off with a large part of the Mufawar coffee which is a medium roasted coffee with a hint of cardamom. We also had them add cream and sugar. This is one of the absolute best coffees I've had. Deep in flavor, smooth, no bitterness at all and will be my go-to next time for sure and I definitely think you'll enjoy it. I love how they serve it in these pots and traditional coffee cups as well. This pot is enough to probably serve four to six people, uh, like four to six cups. So keep that in mind when considering which one to choose. They have a smaller one, a small pot. But I've seen a picture with even a larger pot. So it's just something to keep in mind if you're even going with a larger group. We also tried their Khaliyat al nahl which is like a honeycomb buttercream filled pastry that's drizzled with honey, which is another must try. It's subtly sweet but rich with the cream. Very, very enjoyable. We also tried this beautiful piece of art, the Yemeni latte with sugar. This one's a bit more complex in flavor with ginger and different spices, but not too complicated for the general palate. We tried their Sabaya dessert, a baked pastry with several layers of pastry sheets with butter in between. Finally, we got some of their harissa, also known as baspusa. It's a coconut based dessert, which is a definite must try, one of the best I've had. Alhamdulillah for all these blessings. Hope you enjoyed the short review, HT family. Keep the ummah and humanity in your dua. Salam, family.